Hello, welcome to our business brought to you by Levant TV. Egypt's central bank let the Egyptian pound depreciate for the first time in five months yesterday, a move analysts said would please the international investors that Cairo is courting. The bank said it sold 38.8 million US dollars at a cutoff price of 7.63 pounds per dollar at a regular auction, sending the currency to its weakest level since auctions began in December 2012. The new rate is 1.3% weaker than the rate of £7.53 at the previous auction on Sunday. Foreign investors uh, bought 2.33% of all shares purchased on Saudi Arabia's stock market in June, the first month since new rules allowed more overseas investment in the Arab world's largest bourse. Overseas investors, including uh, residents and holders of swaps and qualified foreign investment licenses, purchased 2.63 billion rials of shares and sold 3.57 billion of shares. The UAE is likely to complete the drafting of laws introducing corporate tax and value-added tax in the third quarter of this year. Yunis Haji Al Khouri, Under Secretary and uh, at the Finance Ministry, added that authorities were still evaluating the social and economic impact of the laws, but drafting was expected to be finished very soon, within the third quarter of his year, but declined to comment on the proposed tax rates or when they might take effect. And telecom operating Orange aims to grow revenue from its Africa and Middle East operation by about 5% a year through 2018 and is looking for expansion opportunities in the region. Orange has about 100 million subscribers in Egypt, Morocco, Tunisia, Senegal and Mali, amongst other countries, and they brought in nearly 10% of group sales last year. Revenues from the region rose by 7% to reach 4.29 billion euros. That's all for today's uh, business news. For more updates, please visit levant.tv. Thanks for watching our business and bye for now.